future Jacob here. I was just involved in a very splashy, wet baby bath that you're going to want to stick around for. So before we get this video kicked off, be sure to like this video, uh, subscribe to our channel, be sure to click that bell so you get the notifications when we post something new, and after you finish watching the video, leave us a comment let us know what you think. Say good morning. Gabriel, say good morning to everybody. <laughs> good morning, everybody. It's still cold and a little wet outside. It's not raining, but it's wet. <laughs> so I have no idea what we're going to do. We don't have any plan for today, which is usually the days that crazy things happen. Isn't that right? We're in the playpen. Spend a lot of time in here now. He and then either me or his mama get in here and play with him. Because it's easy to play with him and keep him contained. Uh huh. Because it used to be we'd put him down on the floor to play with him with the toys. He'd get distracted by the entertainment center, the stereo, or a surge protector. Because this kid likes to go for the most dangerous thing in the room. And he's a fast crawler, so you got to catch up to him quick. Because you can see his little eyes lock onto the surge protector and go, i got to get to that thing quick. What you picking up? You got your cell phone? Thank you. <laughs> he's a hoot. He's been fed. And we are approaching his first nap time, which he does not sh look like he is slowing down at all. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to try to have something to eat because I'm super hungry. Gabriel's down for his nap, so usually I try to get the smoothies made uh, while he's awake. But this morning we were playing in his in his little pack and there's a little playpen, and time kind of got away from me. And then I realized it was time for his nap. So now I've got to make my smoothie, and I have a sleeping baby. So this is real life, y'all. I'm outside. Blender hooked up outside. <laughs> his napping system or whatever is so fragile. I don't want to take any chances. If I make the loud noise that's too loud in there and he wakes up and then he's only gotten a 15 minute nap, the rest of the day is going to be rough. So the bigger the naps, the better. So if I can get him to sleep for at least an hour in the morning and then like an hour and a half later on, that'd be awesome. But I'll settle for two one hour naps. But I'm not running this blender right after my baby went to sleep. <laughs> this kid slept for an hour. Real good nap. It's plenty of time for me to get ready for the day. <laughs> he woke up in a good mood, so we're about to have some sweet potatoes. Because I think he's hungry. Nope, I know he's hungry. <laughs> and then we're going to go for a walk. Because you never know what will happen or what you'll see on your walk. Ready for sweet potatoes? All right. You like your sweet potatoes? Yep. Say so stop talking and feed me more sweet potatoes. Okay, we're out on our walk. We didn't get to go for a walk yesterday because it was raining all day and it was cold. So today it's still cold. Not cold, it's cool in the uh, 50s, mid 50s, I think. Um, but. 
Gabriel's bundled up, and we're going for a little, we're going for a positivity walk and get out of the house because we've been cooped up for a couple days. Here's a question for you, and please answer in the comments. Does anybody have like a cruiser cup or something that does not splatter even when it's closed? Like it's sealed up, but because of the stroller bounces around, it spl splashes around, and I need something that's not gonna splash. Leave it in the comments, let me know what you think, or if you know of something. So this weekend's video should be a fun one. We're, uh, it'll kinda be a kickoff to Christmas video. We are going to start decorating our house and we're going to go to a Christmas store and some things like that. I know that... This kid took off his hat, played with it, and then dropped it. I knew that was going to happen. So now we go shoeless and hatless because we'll lose them all. <laughs> anyway, we decorate for Christmas early every year and I know it's a cardinal sin to some people and then some people I know already have their Christmas trees up but for us um, we leave Dallas and go back home to Louisiana and we do what I call the Louisiana the Christmas Louisiana tour or Louisiana Christmas tour where we <laughs> go to my house my parents house spend a few days and then we go to Sarah's parents house and spend a few days back to my my parents house and then turn around and come right back here so for like a week in a few days or something like that we're in Louisiana not at our house enjoying our Christmas so we put it all up a little bit early so that uh, we can enjoy it I guess the full amount of time that normal people would get to get would get to enjoy their Christmas. And we really like Christmas, so it's really important to us. I remember before we moved here, we had to put our house on the market and couldn't decorate for any of the holidays. Uh, Thanksgiving, our started out with Halloween and I was able to put out like a couple of light up pumpkins and that was it. Cause nobody's gonna buy your house if it looks like a haunted house, right? So I, I did that, I put, put up a couple lighted pumpkins and that was it and then Christmas we couldn't put up a tree couldn't decorate the house couldn't do any of that stuff so it was kind of a bummer to it be full Christmas season and you couldn't do anything you know your house wasn't decorated so we Sarah and I watched a Christmas movie every single day that year while we were, uh, every night, we both got home from work, we'd watch a Christmas movie just to kind of keep that Christmas fire alive. <laughs> but, so now, now that we're not moving, selling a house or anything random like that, we decorate when we want to. So, this weekend, kick off to Christmas. Should be a fun video. So we've been walking around, enjoying the cool weather, you know, and the, looking at the leaves, the, the fall leaves and all that kind of stuff. And, I just happened to glance down at my watch and realized that it is an hour past due for this kid <laughs> to have his next bottle. So now we're going to race home. I'm going to feed this kid because I didn't realize that uh, it was so late. We made it back. I broke a little bit of a sweat and I am kind of out of breath, if I'm going to be honest. I guess I didn't really need to race that bad because he wasn't fussy or anything like that, but he's eating pretty steady so I know he was hungry. I think we might take a nap after this, or he might take a nap, and then I'll figure out what I'm going to do for lunch. I love you, kid. Okay, Gabriel's been fed. He's now napping. He made sure to take a massive dump before he went down. So I got to do that before I got to eat my lunch. Which kind of has a way of killing your appetite a little bit, huh? Now, if someone figured out a way, like uh, some kind of additive, and I know this is absolutely not natural, organic or anything like that, so we would probably wouldn't buy it, but 
if somebody came out with something that got added to formula that made babies poop smell better I think they'd be sitting on some real money there but anyway I'm gonna go force feed myself lunch <laughs> and then hopefully he'll be up in about an hour and we'll play a little bit and then mommy will come home and I think we're going to the grocery store surprise surprise I know right but she's also been talking about needing to get some makeup so uh, we may wander over towards a makeup store and then Gabriel and I will go to a different store while she shops for makeup because we ultimately end up just standing there the stroller can't fit down the aisles I really don't have a lot of interest in what's going on so I push Gabriel over to some one of the more colorful racks and let him look at it from a distance otherwise I can't get close otherwise he'll grab and throw and put on makeup it'll be a mess Look who's up! Uh, I didn't tell you to look up. I said, "Look who's up." Hey. He's in a good mood. He wants the camera. You want to film? Okay. Want to do a little Gabriel cam? Take these people on a ride. <laughs> Still drop it. Here, I don't think anybody wants to look at your walker. I'm gonna smudge the lens. <laughs> He's in a good mood, so we're gonna ride that for a while. after me <laughs> backwards filming what? while looking at us you find it You could do this all day, couldn't you? Sorry about that. Mommy's home. This kid gave us one more dirty diaper before we run to the grocery store. Which if I'm thinking, if I'm being positive about it, then I say, thankfully he did it before we went to the grocery store. And not while we were at the grocery store. It's 
It's Mama. <laughs> Love you. It has begun. Good. I like Christmas. I don't care that they decorate her. I prefer it. As you can see, we got the essentials. <laughs> Christmas everywhere. Makes me not feel bad for decorating this weekend. I found the Thanksgiving decorations. Hmm? Happy babies are other ones. Honestly, don't know. We made it back from the grocery store. Now it's dinner time. Gabriel's gonna have the always delicious. <coughs> Apple turkey cranberry. How excited are you about that? <coughs> yep, he wants it now. <coughs> Alright, he's done eating, so now we're gonna try some baby mum mums, which we have tried a couple of times with little success. He's got the little creamies down. That's easy. You having some trouble with that package? <laughs> well, they're all broken. Well, that looks like a little baby arrowhead. <laughs> Please don't jab yourself in the throat. Oh, that's a bite. Oh, easy on the bites. Easy on the bike. Come on, Mama, let that boy eat. Uh -huh. It's terrifying. Let him eat. Look how much he's putting in his mouth. <laughs> oh. All right, chew it up, and then Mama, give it back. Uh. See, no, give it to him. Give it back to him. Sharp, stick that sharp end in your mouth. See, that hurts. <laughs> you want to this thing? You have baby shank? They look like a cartoon character eating corn. Don't put that much it's in your so mouth. <laughs> All right. So, points for chewing. <laughs> but we may need to work on the amount we chew. The bite size. And now it's bath time. <laughs> bath time! Well, sometimes bath time is so crazy that you go to shoot the clothes and you think you push the record button and you didn't push the record button, so when you do push the record button to stop recording, you actually film yourself walking away for 10 minutes. So and that is exactly what happened with the clothes from last night. So I'm editing the video together and realize I don't have a clothes. So here it is. Don't hold, us again. hold it against us. Uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Uh, leave us a comment. Tell us what you think. And as always, please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And be sure to click that bell so you get the notifications when we post a new video. So thanks for watching. Uh, this weekend will be Christmas kickoff. So you're going to want to tune in on Monday. Or uh, catch our video on Monday for the fun Christmas kickoff video. So thanks again for watching. See y'all later.